guys, it's B-Dog here and I am really on behind schedule here for these videos. I haven't really am behind schedule for any of it. So, um, some of the videos came by on Friday, two videos came on Friday, but one video came on yesterday. So, I'm just gonna caught on to them. Three videos I need to caught on and that's about it. So, um, we're gonna get through our very first one of three videos I had to catch up. So, um, let's get to our first one. So, Today, we're going to react to Glitch newest upload, Rising Tiles. So, um, this is our first out of three. So, um, without further ado, i got to get this over with. So then, three, two, one, let's get this over with. Oh, well, so three, two, one, go. Hey guys, hey. We've been talking to a lot of people in and around the TV animation scene recently and we've been noticing a very common difficult problem that we've all been facing and that's funding an animated show is <coughs> incredibly <coughs> difficult and making a full season is even harder. In particular, we've been talking to the folks over at Like a Hey Tracy, how things been? This past year with the amazing generous support of fans, I've been in the dream come true position of being able to develop and work on a Lack of Daisy animated series oh. alongside a team of incredible artists. We're <clears> deep <throat> into production on season one and nothing's gonna stop us. But as an indie show, we don't have the kind of financial backing that big studio productions have. Oh. And animation takes a lot of time and a lot of hands to make. So beyond crowd funds, we know we need a long-term plan for sustaining budget and making episodes that are as long and as great as we can envision them to be. Of course, unless we want to sell our souls to the powers that be, that means funding ourselves with merch. That's why when Glitch reached out to us and told us they were launching their own merch branch, we leapt at the chance to work with them. When we heard this, we wanted to help. That is why we're happy to announce that we will be partnering with them, designing manufacturing and distributing their merchandise. Oh, okay. What? Wait, no. the final final project, that isn't Glitch, Kevin. Well, yes, Luke, and also no. You see, Glitch will always be focused on making indie animation. So to make it clear, we made our own merchandise company called Final Final Project. All right. Okay then. Final Final Project or FFP is here with one core goal and that is to make high quality merchandise for all of you guys while supporting creators how we can along the way. And I forgot what I was going to say. That's okay Luke, you have cats. Yes. <laughs> that's right, creators like Tracy should only be focusing on one thing and that's making awesome animated <laughs> shows. This means we get to introduce a whole new shop and a whole new and improved line of Black Daisy merch, all while being part of Glitch's pioneering effort to make indie animation into a reliable, viable means for producing top-tier internet cartoons. I just want to send out a huge thank you to Kevin, Luke, Jasmine, and the rest of the Glitch team. You've been just amazing to work with. Despite everything going on in the mainstream these days, what you're doing fills me with hope for the future of animation. So hey, okay. if you'd like to be part of the indie revolution too, check out the cool new stuff we've introduced over at the Black Daisy shop. That's lackadaisyshop.com. Let's make some things right. together. Thanks so much, Tracy. We are really excited to help you out on this, and we're looking forward to all the cool stuff we're going to make together. And if you haven't yet, please go check out Lackadaisy over on YouTube. It is an amazing pilot about gangster cats. High five. <laughs> all right. True enough. True free. True enough. So um, that's one down, two to go. So we had to get through everything around here so that was the easiest one ever so um so one down two more to go and then after this i'm done here for add on to next sunday because i had to postpone another video next week and then the following week another video so um actually no on monday the 22nd i will be doing smg4 videos smg4 fit new video on the 22nd because I will be going somewhere on a Sunday so I will be postponing to from the 20th to the 22nd so then that's it for this one um check out glitch for more stuff in the future go check them out for more things like this check out my channel leave a like subscribe comment post a notification bell and share it when me on Follow me on Instagram, X, TikTok, and Twitch. Find me on Nintendo Switch, Snapchat, and Discord. My dream mattress for Animal Crossing New Horizons is in the description down below. 
Animal Crossing DLC, Mario Kart DLC, Nintendo Switch Sports, and Fall Guys. Four of them out two years ago. Splatoon 3 already out a year ago. So um, check out my Discord and that's it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Yep, that's just wrong. Of course. So you have your minions do all the dirty work and reap all the benefits for yourself? I like the way you do business, SMG4. No, no, SMG3. It's not just the leggies cooking up the memes. Well, just the other day, I cooked up this little meme. <laughs> wow, that's just messy. That's what makes this place special. In the meme kitchen, anyone can cook. Yeah, you're anyone right. Can cook. Anyone can cook. Anyone can cook. Oh, no, not Luigi. Why, of course.